guys, today we're going to be going over how to finish the guillotine from standing up. I'm going to start off with a collar tie on my opponent, right hand in the back of the head, left hand to the bicep. I'm controlling the inside space here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to push her back. I'm going to try to get her to move. If my opponent doesn't want to move, what they're going to do is set their weight. They might even lean forward on me. At that point, I'm going to snap them down. I don't count on driving them all the way to the ground, but if it happens, be ready. I want them to bend over. I'm going to put my lat on top of their head, swing my arm underneath until my hand comes out the other side. I'm going to grab my own wrist, about halfway down my wrist. I'm going to grab here. I'm going to walk up. I'm going to stand tall. I make my chest as big as I can, and I don't pick them up. I walk forward. That's going to impinge the neck. It's going to crush, cause the choke to happen on this side. I don't want to, you'll have to, my wife will have to forgive me and she'll jump with me. I don't, I don't want to pick her up. It's going to run their throat and it's going to suck and they're going to gag, but they're not going to tap because it's very brief and I'm going to drop them again right away. To apply a good, strong strangle, I'm going to walk toward them. Like I'm trying to put my hips underneath them. Again, we're right here. I get this snap down by driving her forward. Here, under, grab right up my own wrist. Here, walk forward. Very tight, very uncomfortable. One more time. Elbow comes up really high. 